So another day, another set of Fallout 4 videos, guys. Welcome back. Thank you guys so much for all your support. Uh, right now, we're, we just got the Diamond City. I didn't know this, but the VAT system is actually in this game. Like, I can blow this dude's head off if I really wanted to right now, but I'm not going to. Because I'm trying to not cause chaos. Uh, right now, we I think our current objective, let me see. Uh, just hit level 6, got two stem packs. I like how that's a quick... That's actually kind of cool how they got on the bottom right there. You see that's like a quick thing you can use. How many perks do we have? Nothing new. Alright, our quest line is right here. Go to the Valentine's... Or, Valentine's Detective Agency. I think that's actually here. We got Diamond City Surplus. What's that all about? Alright, we got Fallon's Basement. Kim, I care. I like that. Look at this. What is this? Hey, God, what? What are you saying? Tell me a joke. No. Thought maybe I'd get some experience for that. I guess not. I want to search. Oh, you can't go to people's. Oh, you got to be novice to get that. We're not quite there yet, guys. Let's go back here. We got the schoolhouse. Detective. What is this? Oh, we can go in. Nice. Road to freedom. Follow the freedom trail. What? Harvest. There's nothing really in there. Oh, well. I'm going to go ahead and apologize right now. If you hear me sneeze in this video, I try to edit out any time I cough or sneeze or whatever, but I've been a little sick uh, today, so I've... What the hell? What the shit is this? Hey, newcomer, huh? Talk to Abbott at the wall if you want to history lesson. Straight up creeping. What is that all about? Valentine Detective Agency. Let's get it, guys. <laughs> Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. Ooh, I get the persuasion. Here we go. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just... The detective... He's gone missing. Do you have any idea how I could find him? He disappeared working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Hey, I'd love to help, but there's the small matter of expenses. Money, huh? I, I do have 125 caps in the old rainy day fund. I can keep going. <laughs> Come on. This is your boss's life we're talking about here. Don't play games with me. I'll pay you if you find Nick, but it's going to be a hundred caps. That's the reward, and it's not up for negotiation. I guess it didn't always work. I thought because it was yellow, like maybe it would actually work every time. I guess not. Who's this skinny Malone character? I don't know much about him, but he's from Good Neighbor, and that means he's in the well-pressed suits and machine gun school of thuggery. You said Malone's from Good Neighbor? Yeah, it's a tough neighborhood. Northeast of ways. People with power there care about two things. Style and body count. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please, hurry. Jewel of the Commonwealth. Did you see Codsworth actually like that? That was pretty badass. Pack of cigarettes. I'm scared to grab anything because it's all like in red. And that's just gonna stir things up. Started unlikely Valentine. Nice. Alright, let's go. Our 
Alright, so we're really close to both things. Um, unless there's something that I planted on the map and don't remember. What is this? What does it say? Silver Shroud needs you. That's pretty badass. I love the amount of detail. I'm going to tell you right now, this, I did not e actually expect this game to do as well as it has so far on my channel. Uh, I really can't thank you guys enough. It means the world to me that this is doing as well as it is. Because this is a long game and I wanted to actually take my time and, it's, and experience it. And I was going to play it regardless if it did well or not. But just the fact that it is, is amazing. So I thank you for that. On inside. I gotta see something really quick because on our map. Okay, unlikely Valentine, that's fine. Uh, let me look at my map really quick. Look at this thing. I wonder if you can take control of it. That would be so badass if you could do that. Okay, Trinity Tower radio signal. We found it. We gotta go over here. Find Nick Valentine. Let's see if you can fast travel. Haven't discovered it yet, so we can't do that. Oh, you could actually fast travel to that ship. That's so crazy that you can actually do that. Okay, we just gotta follow these areas. Oh, look at these skyscrapers, man. There's so much detail in this game. Like, it just blows me away how much... I guess how, how big this game actually is. Like, it's really massive. I wonder on a scale if it's actually bigger than Grand Theft Auto V. That was... That was a huge game. That's... That was such a good series. I forgot about that game. Alright. Wait for it. It's over! Uh, let's see... Actually worked out nicely. I'm not even gonna grab this. I think I already have all those things. I thought I thought if he was a good guy for a minute. Whoa, why is it? What? It actually like stopped for a second. Did you see that? Are right, we good? Had a blue bandana. I'm taking that shit. You know what it is? Uh, once we get, I'm hoping to get a weapon that's like a rifle that can basically, it's like a sniper rifle that can one shot kill everything. Oh, nice! I love experience. Like if you find all the areas, you can fast travel there. I think that's. Something that they've always done in Bethesda games that I've loved. I was trying to think of the last game we played by Bethesda, because I did play Skyrim back in 2011. I think it was 2011. Sorry for the weird cut. I had like a sneeze attack just happen. I don't know if I'm like allergic to something. I don't know what's going on. So I apologize about that. And also got killed while I was sneezing. So I got had to restart and get back to this area. I'm going to keep running. We're not too far away from that area, but I didn't want to, like, cut to when I got there because I think that takes away too much from the series. Um, I was, you know what I was about to say? I was going to see what the last Bethesda game I played. I know I talked about Skyrim for a second. Um, all the mannequins look freaky. Still reminds me of I Am Legend. That is some freaky shit, guys. And then, uh, you know what? It was The Evil Within and Wolfenstein, The New Order, and The Old Blood. Like, th I think those were the last games that I played by them. Okay, we're going to the left over here. There's got to be something good in here. Yes, explosive box. I'll take it. Boston Common. Oh, shit. Radiation. That same sound effect, too. Can you not walk on this? No, you can't. 
It says drink the water. I think I'll pass. I love how the radio signals go in and out too as you get closer. What the shit? Welcome, Patriot, to Boston Common. The start of the freedom trade. Feast your ears and learn more about the historic freedom. At Journey's End, follow Freedom's Lantern. Welcome, Patriot, to Boston Common. The start of the I'm gonna see if there's any in here. It has to be, right? Nothing in there. That's just no good. You can, uh, uh, you know, what? I forgot you can transfer stuff to different things in the game. The fact that I would be worried that it would actually remember that I put that there. I'm telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this. Holy shit, guys. Really? It's almost like that thing was blocking it, so... Nice. There we go. Alright, where's my... I'm gonna go ahead and... Iguana bites. Alright, we're good. Hit me up with the radiation, that's fine. I can, uh, whenever I get a chance to, I'll go through and change that up a little bit. 10 millimeter pistol, what? I'm not going to take this man slacks. That's just disrespectful. Wait, wait. We got one more. Submachine gun. I've actually heard that this... Now, this is all rumor. I don't know if this is true. I don't know anybody that's actually beat this game yet. But I've heard that if you just stick to the main story, it's not that long. But that's kind of the same way. It's true for... Uh, True for Skyrim as well. It was the same way. In Fallout 3, you could actually stick to the main story and just go straight. I think there was a speed run. Some guy beat that entire game in like two or three hours. Something ridiculous. Get some fire going down there. Keep them nice and warm. Yeah, take it, bitch. I don't know if it's an instant kill or not, but... Is that not gonna explode? I guess not. Let me reload just in case. Let me try something. There was this right here. The pipe rifle. I don't know if it's any different. Now, this is nice. It's a single burst. The other one's like a fully automatic. Oh yeah, it's definitely a nice weapon. Armors and crippled? Are you kidding? Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to eat some of this. Again. Let me see something really quick. Uh, my aid. Wait, wait. I don't know, guys. I'm trying to figure out, like... Okay, the ammo. There's right there. I don't need that. I'm trying to just figure out, uh... I'll have to patch up here in a minute. Where is oh, there it goes! I got one! That's what I missed about Fallout 3, man. Man, that was amazing. I look good on next gen too. All right, well, all out war zone down here. I'll take it. 
squirrel on a stick. What? It's gonna be good. What was he doing with that with his pants, though? What's he got a squirrel on his pants for? He's gonna freak to death. I don't want to send him down there. Tell him to go over there and see what happens. He might actually go beast mode. I'm gonna chill back here for a second. Uh, stat. Alright, we're good. I'm about to go look at the perks and see if there's anything I can do in the meantime, but I guess not. Alright, I'm good to go. Nice. Codsworth is really useful. I've heard the dog actually can attack people as well. I just have not had a chance to really try that out yet. We've pretty much murdered everyone over here. This is one of those games I do not want to end. It is just... It's too well done. Alright, I don't even know where these bodies are. I didn't see any. We gotta go all the way down here? What? Aluminum can. Anything else? Did that say dirty water? Hang on. Oh, yes. Still looking for this Valentine guy. I don't know if it's... I feel like I'm about to get jumped again. Yep, there's some more people over there. Got some nice headshots on that guy. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's get it. How I actually missed those shots, I will never know. Still alive, are we? What? There we go. Are oh, we supposed to get up here? All right, let me take all this ammo and stuff. I need to get... Oh, pork and beans? Submachine gun? Let's get it. All right, a worn fedora. That's a little pretentious. I'm not going to put that on. All right, we finally made it over here. Vault 114. All right. When we come back next time, I'll start this uh, little area. I'm going to explore Vault 114. And with that being said, I love you and take it easy.